Hello there beautiful beings and welcome to my sacred space. My name is Raven and tonight I'm going to give you a flip through and my first impressions of, well not really first impressions but kind of like a review of the Cosmic Reading Cards by Nari and Starsha. Quite an interesting name, Starsha, Star. Isn't that cool? This is a deck for activation of your soul. Pretty amazing. So this is a rock pool deck. And I call it the reading cards line, but that's just me. That's how, just how I call it. And it does come with this special guidebook. It usually has a tray. I'm going to pull out my other reading cards, uh, healing, uh, what do you call that? <laughs> reading cards deck, the packaging, it does it usually comes with a tray. Um, so this is a deck by Rockpool. Rockpool is a publishing house in Australia. Now let's have a look at the guidebook. Oh, if you're here just for the flip through, please go ahead and check out the description. Um, oh, sorry, <laughs> the timestamp in my description box and have a look at the cards. Um, this deck is actually gifted to me by an Aquarian Sense. Thank you so much for sending this my way. So let's have a look at the guidebook because I, li I like reading through the guidebook. Not the whole thing, you know, but I'm pretty sure there are other people out there who are quite interested in guidebooks. It just it can't just be me right so here you have this is a deck initially published in 2016 and you know similar to all the rockpool um, reading cards line they do have the very nice quality paper um, for their guidebooks and here you go alrighty so you have uh, instructions on how to use the cards and then you have spreads um, and then psychic development so you know if you do have like i don't know if you feel like you have you're gifted then maybe this is a deck that's you know great for you to strengthen those gifts and then she talks about chakras energy layers and colors and then exercise Ooh, i would love to do this and on to the meanings of the cards so that's pretty cool and i love how they have this like blue um border not really a border what do you call that edging <laughs> and if you do it if you stretch it out like this it looks like that so that's pretty cool so you'd have a full um image or on your left page and on your right you have the meaning of the card and what i love about rockpool reading cards line decks are you know you to have a lot of information but at the same time they also provide you with um additional information at the bottom like this one it provides you with a prayer um other decks provide you with affirmations while others actually provide you like they give you with you know thought-provoking questions so that's very interesting as well especially if you like doing um journaling you know or daily polls here we have patience the images are very bizarre but of course you know it comes with a name it's a cosmic deck so it does it's otherworldly in a, in you know other words this i don't know it it doesn't feel like it's from outer space i feel like this is from within do you know what i mean it's very strange but the energy that's coming through here is i feel like you know these are neurons you know how when you think things um your neurons light up and that's that's what really i'm getting goosebumps just by looking at that very interesting now let's have a look at the cards oh we we're actually going to proceed with the flip through right now so i'm going to put on some music Thank you. 
that's the full flip through of the Cosmic Reading Cards deck by Nari Anastasia. As you can see, it was quite quick because the, well, some of, well, most of the reading cards line decks that I have, it's just about 37 cards. Let me see. We didn't check how many cards we have here. 36. So there you go. Um, and as you can see, you know, it is dark. It is dark. Um, it's a little, you know, more bluish. But of course, it has that dark vibe, dark feel. So I feel like this deck is really perfect for getting attuned to yourself. Do you know what I mean? Like even your shadow side, like the keywords also speak of that, like self-worth, move forward, surrender, be fearless. So I guess if you have like, you know, the chance to do some shadow work, this would be the perfect deck to pull. I also noticed that it is very important, you know, for us to be connected to Mother Earth as much as we are connected to our, Earth, our spiritual side. Um, and you know, see, those are leaves, right? And it's just so gorgeous to me. And I love how, you know, some of the images, another one that has leaves. And I love how the images are kind of like abstract, but at the same time, if you stare at it a little bit longer, you would see more images, like more of them would form. And that's very cool. And also, you know, like I said, it's dark, but you would have like light over there. I'm not sure. Let me just try to focus. No, it won't focus, but you know, there's more to it. It's just very eye popping in a way. Um, let's talk about the cardstock. It is your typical um, rock pool cardstock. As you can see, this is quite glossy. It's not a matte deck. Um, it does have borders. I think this is a pretty old deck. When was this released? 2016, if I remember correctly. Um, but there you go. That is the deck. What do you guys think? Are you keen to study? more about your connection to the universe and at the same time your connection to your inner self <laughs> let me know what you guys think about this deck if you have any questions please feel free to leave them in the comments section i do respond to comments as soon as i can and of course i would like to end this video by expressing my gratitude again to anna of antiquarian sense thank you so much for this you're truly amazing if you enjoyed this video please give this a like or please subscribe to my channel for future videos like this thank you bye